है एवरी वन वेलकम और वेलकम बैक टू माई चैनल कैसे हैं आप लोग मैं ठीक ठाक हूँ आज हम एक वीडियो देखने वाले हैं बहुत ही इंटरेस्टिंग डिफरेंट टाइप के मुझे कुछ टाइम पहले किसी ने बोला था कि टी सीरीज जो है वो आ, दुनिया का मोस्ट सब्सक्राइब चैनल होने वाला है तो मैंने सोचा था ऑलरेडी कि मेरे को ये मैं वीडियो करूँगी और मुझे लगता है आज हमें ये वीडियो करनी चाहिए तो इंटरेस्टिंग टाइप की हो जाएगी थोड़ी डिफरेंट भी है तो पहले वीडियो देखते हैं उसके बाद बातें करेंगे If you're like me, you assume the rest of the world revolves around you. <laughs> But every now and then I'll pop my head out of the sand to try to take stock of what's going on outside of my world, America and English speaking YouTube. And it's a good time to start paying attention because some of the new biggest channels in the world are building their audiences <laughs> totally outside of western countries, which means you probably haven't heard of them yet. And the one we're going to pay attention to today is T series from India. T series is growing so fast, they're set to pass PewDiePie in subscriber numbers in fewer than 6 months. Oh my god, we're going to talk this. about why and how T series got to the top. Was it luck, timing, fortune? We're going to talk all of that and more. But before we get into how T series shot up the YouTube ladder, let's give a little bit of background. T series is a Bollywood music production company started by Gulshan Kumar. They originally sold bootleg Bollywood songs, but after some smart moves, explosive growth, and their founder being assassinated by the Mumbai underworld, they emerged on top in the Bollywood music scene, especially on YouTube, where they are the second largest channel in the world right now. But let's make that more tangible with numbers. PewDiePie is set to grow by 9 million subscribers this year. In that same time period, T series will get 38 million oh subscribers. God, to give you more context for how fast that growth is, there are only 3 channels in the world with more than 38 million subscribers total, and they're going to gain that many subscribers in 1 year according to growth trends. At first glance, this growth is completely baffling. How is this possible? At this point I'm just going to show you a few of their videos to give you a flavor of the kind of work that they do. Hazir Oh Shreya Ishq ki mehfil mein Ha mere sunne sunne Kaise mood acha ho jata hai I mean it's good but Good content doesn't explain the full picture. There are tons of good music video channels that aren't growing nearly this fast. So what else is going on here? Well, it's ironic. The same thing that helped PewDiePie, the YouTube king, get to where he is, is now what is creating the new king of YouTube. It comes down to two factors. These factors are geographic opportunity and content ecosystems. Mm. Let's start with geographic opportunity. Five years ago, Matt Pat made a video called "How PewDiePie Conquered YouTube," and in it, he argued PewDiePie had a unique advantage based on where he was from. Basically, PewDiePie was able to draw from a larger audience pool than his contemporaries, which gave him the geographic opportunity to get ahead. Today, the place to be if you want geographic opportunity and the largest audience is India. India has always had a huge population, but what held India back in the past was having bad or no internet connection. Mm-hmm. But recently, especially in the last decade, this has been radically changing. I don't want to bore you with too many numbers, but India has been coming online rapidly. To illustrate oh this, there's God. a great metric called internet US penetration, which just measures the percentage of the country using the internet. Simple. So to get a baseline, here are the last two decades in the U.S. Pretty stagnant. Mm-hmm. Nearly everyone who wants to be on the internet is on the internet. Yeah. Now compare this with the last two decades of internet penetration in India. It's pretty staggering. And as far as absolute number of internet users, India in is already America. well past the U.S. and oh Europe, and is only behind China in total users. And that's despite the fact that they still have a long way to grow, having only reached 30% penetration compared to the Guys, 80% of most countries. Guys, you told me about Jio's story. And leaving the geopolitical implications of this aside for a moment, on YouTube, this means only one thing. Holy cow! There are a lot of people looking for content in India, and more new users log on every single day. Mm-hmm. Let's do the math. Exponential audience size, hungry for content. Who is the biggest channel in India ready to give the people what they want? T series. T series. They're soaking up all oh of the new users sun. like a sponge. But as if that wasn't enough, T series has one other advantage that seals the coffin for the bro PewDiePie and just the rest of YouTube. 
The India content ecosystem is young, and because of that, ah, competition is weaker. In America, you may not realize it, but we have a pretty India. mature content ecosystem. What I mean by that is, while in the beginning things were like the Wild West on YouTube, the environment has grown with its creators. We've had people creating full time for a while now. We've had large companies use YouTube for success. Oh God, We've even had a generation of creators like me who grew up watching YouTube. Just Everyone's just had time to learn and adapt. This is a great thing for content. It means there's more content than ever, and it's better than ever, generally speaking. But it also means that competition for your eyeballs oh is God, fiercer yes. than ever yes. in America and Europe. True. Today, we have plenty of established channels with professional budgets all True. competing with one another. This makes it hard to cut through and to really stand out, even for the biggest and best channels. This is also why people who start gaming channels today have no chance of becoming as big as PewDiePie. Oh my God, he did it when the genre was new, young, and yeah, undefined. Yeah, just like getting people first. Don't get me wrong; come. someone can still succeed on YouTube, but being first to market is always a unique advantage. Always. If PewDiePie started today, he'd be just one of a thousand similar personalities, mm -hmm. all shouting for the same breathing room. Uh. And just contrast this with India. Where new creators are just we'll starting to take advantage of the huge opportunity over there, most Being of the Indian. audience and the creators have only I'm recently gotten it. internet access, which means that India's YouTube content environment is at minimum several years younger than most mm -hmm. developed countries. This has created a unique moment for a professional operation like T Series, who can afford to mass produce mm -hmm. big budget music videos, sure. to dominate the competition and grab the market share before so anyone else gets there. there. Now I know what you're thinking. What about the elephant in the room? China? China? China because China. China. You would think all these factors the apply best. equally to them as well. <laughs> Why aren't we seeing the oh T series God. of China? After all, they have just as large of a population. <laughs> They're actually ahead of India in their technological boom, which means a larger potential audience size. What's holding them back? Well, China is the story of what might have been. Want me to ban you? You do the Great Wall of China, the Great Firewall, that is. You may have heard, the Chinese government censors the internet, and starting from the 2008 riots in Tibet, one website they blocked is YouTube. So while China has their own YouTube called Yuku, which is a totally original title, it's mostly a national <laughs> brand. Typical so China. now at least, it looks like yeah, India's friendliness towards globalization will make it a stronger competitor in worldwide entertainment. While China's nationalist policies have meant that national brands like Yuku will succeed, which is an interesting trade-off. China prevents their population from engaging oh my with God, global, sometimes better products, but in turn, it gives their local companies that normally would have been outcompeted a long time ago the chance to grow into huge corporations which can fight on the world stage for influence. But it's hard to tell how successful any of their creators have been, since they're not playing on the same field as any other country. You really can't compare numbers. If you don't go to the Olympics, you can't win a medal, no matter how many people exactly. you have banging your drums. So to summarize this video, China is playing by themselves, insulating their internet platform Why? so that it can survive Why and grow, though? while India is choosing to leverage its huge population to participate in the larger community. And with its technological boom only getting started, soon India will be a major player in the YouTube ecosystem. It looks like Bollywood music is here to stay. Which is cool with me, because have you ever seen a Bollywood movie? Oh, Their action heroes have a level of badassery that breaks the badass meter <laughs> and turns into videos comedy, really realistic which is hilariously really amazing. amazing. Yeah, I'll just outro with the future YouTube people relate to Bollywood, so people just relate that this is what it is. It's not that you can make other movies. It's not that people like it. Come on, why are you showing this? गाइस ये थी वीडियो मुझे लगा था थोड़ी ठंडी टाइप की यू नो थोड़ी बोरिंग टाइप की होगी लेकिन मेरे को काफी फन क्या कहते हैं मजा आया देख के गाइस मुझे इतनी बड़ी क्यूरियोसिटी है आप लोगों ने मुझे जियो के बारे में इतना बताया कि मेरे को अब पूरी तरह से याद हो गया उसके कितने फायदे हैं और वो इतना अफोर्डेबल इतना ऑसम पैकेज है आपको क्या लगता है आपने मुझे बताया था वो रिसेंटली शुरू हुआ जब से वो शुरू हुआ आप लोग इंटरनेट बहुत ज्यादा यूज करते हो और क्या यही रीजन है कि लोग वहाँ पे इंटरनेट यूजर इतनी तेजी से बढ़ गए हैं कि वो यूएसए को पीछे छोड़ दिया आई यूएसए आपको पता है इंटरनेट कितना कंज्यूम करता है लेकिन अगर आप उसको भी पीछे छोड़ गए इसका मतलब है कि कुछ क्रेडिट इसको जियो को भी जाना चाहिए आई मीन मुझे आप लोगों ने बताया कि दूसरे भी कंपनीज हैं जो अच्छा तो पैकेज देती हैं लेकिन आई थिंक ज़्यादातर यूजर अभी तक जितने मैंने देखे हैं वीडियो के नीचे आप लोग देखते हैं वो जियो के ही होते हैं तो मे भी उसको थोड़ा सा क्रेडिट मिलना चाहिए मुझे लास्ट में जो उसने दिखाया मुझे इतना पसंद नहीं है क्योंकि अभी तक लोगों को मिसकसेप्शन है कि बॉलीवुड बस ये ही है यू नो और वो मूवीज़ देखते भी नहीं है वो बस एक दो फनी टाइप की ट्रेलर देख लेते हैं और वो ज्यूम कर लेते हैं कि अभी भी 
यू नो यही है मेरे लिए मूवी देखना इतना मुश्किल होता है जब तक वो बहुत ही अच्छी क्यों ना उसका कंटेंट अच्छा ना हो मैं देख नहीं जाती और नॉर्मली मैं हॉलीवुड की मूवीज़ देखती नहीं लास्ट टाइम पता नहीं मैंने कब देखती मुझे याद नहीं मैं उनके शोज देखती हूँ अमेरिकन लेकिन मैं उनकी मूवीज़ नहीं देखती लेकिन जो इंडियन मूवीज़ है वो मेरे को देखने हो जाती हैं क्योंकि ये सच नहीं कि इस तरह की फाइटिंग सीन सिर्फ होते हैं और ये एग्जैजरेट वाली जो मूवीज़ होती हैं वो आप बनना बंद होगी जो बीच में थोड़ी बहुत होती भी हैं वो उनका जॉनर ही ऐसे होता है और वो उसकी भी एक ऑडियंस है लेकिन ज़्यादातर जो मूवीज़ बनती हैं इंडिया में वो बिल्कुल रियलिस्टिक टाइप की होती है मुझे तो बहुत पसंद आती हैं और एक और बात जो मैं कहना चाहती थी कि जो थी सीरीज था कोई भी इंडियन कॉन्टेंट है वो सिर्फ इंडिया के लोग कंज्यूम नहीं करें वो बांग्लादेश के पाकिस्तान के वो मुझे तो लगता है एशिया के काफ़ी सारे कंट्रीज़ हैं वो उसको फॉलो करते हैं बल्कि एशिया भी नहीं सिर्फ मैंने आपको जैसे बताया था मेरे काफ़ी सारे फॉरेन फ्रेंड्स हैं जो वैसे ही पसंद करते हैं इंडिया इंडियन कंटेंट को उनको जबान समझ नहीं आ रही तो उनको कुछ समझ नहीं आ रहा था लेकिन वो फिर भी जाके यू नो स्पेशली म्यूज़िक देखते हैं और उनको सारे जो एक्टर्स हैं उनके फेवरेट उनके नाम भी पता है उनको हिंदी आती नहीं है लेकिन वो जाके देखते हैं उसने बिल्कुल भी मैंशन नहीं किया कि जो लोग हिंदी स्पीकिंग नहीं भी हैं वो भी इस कॉन्टेंट को पसंद करते हैं और वो भी जाके सब्सक्राइब करते वो भी देखते हैं और भी कंट्रीज हैं जो उसको बहुत ही पसंद करते हैं इंडियन कंटेंट को कैसे आप बताओ आपको क्या लगता है क्या एक्जैक्टली रीजन है टी सीरीज की सक्सेस की और क्या आप लोगों को ऑलरेडी पता था कि ये हो रहा है और मुझे इतना फनी लगता है जैसे चाइना जैसे कंट्रीज में वो कंटेंट को ब्लॉक करते हैं अपनी कंट्री में ये सबसे बुरी चीज़ ये जुल्म है तुम्हारी पॉपुलेशन पे तुम बेसिकली उनको इम्पोज कर रहे हो कि तुमने क्या देखना है क्या नहीं और तुम डिसाइड करे और ये इससे पता चलता है कि कोई कंट्री कितना टॉलरेंट है और ये मुझे बहुत ही चाइल्डिश तरीका लगता है मिच्योर नहीं है लाइक तुम कैसे ब्लॉक कर सकते हो कुछ चीज़ें तुम बेसिकली बता रहे हो अपनी पॉपुलेशन को कि देखो ये जो मैंने डिसाइड किया तुम देखोगे इसके अलावा तुम नहीं देख सकते और तुम्हें चॉइस देनी चाहिए तुम्हारी पॉपुलेशन को वो खुद डिसाइड करेंगी है गाइज आप लोग बताओ आपको पता था ये न्यूज़ के बारे में आप लोगों को क्या लगता है क्या रीज़न है एग्जैक्टली कि टी सी ज़्यादा सब्सक्राइब चैनल होने वाला है जो मैंने जियो की बात की है जियो इंटरनेट की या जो भी अफोर्डेबल इंटरनेट है इंडिया में उसकी वजह से आपको लगता है कि एकदम से इतना लोगों ने यूज़ करना शुरू कर दिया और आप कितना टाइम गुजारते हैं इंटरनेट पर आपको कोई लाइक आपके घर वाले कोई बुरा तो नहीं मानते कि आप इतना टाइम इंटरनेट पर गुजार रहे हो ये थी मेरी वीडियो गाइज आई होप कि आपको लोगों को पसंद आई हो अगर आपको पसंद है तो लाइक करो जो मैंने पूछा है प्लीज़ बताओ और हम मिलेंगे नेक्स्ट वीडियो में अपना हाल रखो खुश रहो और बाय